Hey there, it's Daniel from thegoodags.com where you can get free Google Docs templates and guides. Now let's get and then customize the free poster template for Google Docs. So there is something you want to tell publicly and make it notable. Some event, your services promotion, announcements and etc. And for that it has to be bright and eye-catching. But well, you're not a graphic designer and you want to have it in as little time as possible. Thankfully, we have lots of time-saving templates for different occasions. And Google Docs makes it really easy to use. Just get the template from the web and edit it right away. Here, we're getting a poster template for Google Docs from the web and then editing it. First up, make sure you are signed into your Google account. The simplest way to check that is to go to google.com. And on the Google homepage, at the top right corner, check if there's your profile picture or an icon with a person if you don't have it. This means you are signed in and you can skip this part. If not, you will have this sign in button, so press on it. Here, enter either your email address or a phone number linked to the account. I'm using my email and then press next over here. Now on this page, enter your password and next over here. You will be redirected back to the Google homepage and here you are signed in that you can always check by looking at the top right corner here. And if there's your profile picture or an icon with a person, you're good to go. From here, simply search for templates with a query like Google Docs Poster Template Free. Or if you go to some particular website with poster templates like the Google Docs Free Templates and enter. Here's the GoodDocs.com, pressing on it. And here on the homepage, let's get something good. Go to the templates on top. That will open a drop down, and here you need this marketing column. And the last item here, the posters. On this page, there are basically thousands of different poster templates, all free for you, so pick whichever you like and use it absolutely free of charge. As you can see, there are Google Docs and Slides formats. And first, we will filter the search with this drop down and select Docs. Pick the one you like, suitable for your occasion. I personally like simple ones and I will choose this Christmas Wrath poster. Now, this on the left is a preview of the template. And if you like it, click the Red Edit Template on the right. A free format it is. Now waiting for the download to start. And then Google Docs will ask you if you want to copy the template that we just confirmed. Wait a bit. And it will open in a new tab as a common Google document. But now it's yours, located on your drive. You can use it however you want. And now we're going to change it a bit to demonstrate how you can use it. This one is really simple and it's meant to be modified as little as possible. The principle is to choose the template exactly for your occasion. So what you can do here, first of all, change the text and insert the information you need. So I can change the date here to, let's say, April 9, 2022. Then you can change its name to whatever you want. And then the main text here. I will clear this one, then copy the prepared text and paste it here. You can change the text color, formatting, font style and others. And then for the social item, we're going to insert a link to exactly your event. Though, for example, I'll just give a link to my Facebook profile. So, let me get it. Then highlight the text, go to insert on the toolbar and down to the link. And now paste the link into this field and hit apply. Text turned blue and got underlined, indicating that it contains a link. And if you click on this text, it will show a link and I can go to its source. And the same concerning the next item for Instagram. And then you can change the address. And if you'd like, you can change the page color and the image. That's done quick and easy as well. For the page color, we'll get a file on the toolbar. And then page setup at the bottom. 
Here you can see the page color, so open the drop down and choose the one you like. I'll pick the darker magenta. And OK to apply. For the image here, select it and delete it. Insert yours or I'll go to Google and search for Christmas tree. Then images. And then maybe this one. Now save it to your computer with the right mouse. Then go on and locate it in the Explorer. Then go back to the poster and just drag and drop it right here. Doesn't fit well and let's fix that. Go to the bottom of the image. And on this little bar, click on the last but one item. And then just put it over a text. And then click on the next item and select Fix Position. Ok, now let's drag it back to the poster and decrease it. Just pull either of the squares around the image. Now let me put it in place better. And here we go. Could have been better, but that's up to you. Hundreds more guides and a lot of free Google Docs templates on thegoodax.com following the link below the video. Like to help share our videos to more people and subscribe to see more guides. I hope we helped you. Thank you for watching.